Welcome to the Windows Club. A lot of users have reported that options for open, print, edit, etc. are missing from the context menu, which is the menu you get upon right clicking a file or a group of files when they select more than one options. And if you are one of these users, then either read through this article on the Windows Club or simply watch this video. The logic is that if you select more than 15 files, then Windows will disable the options for open, print, edit, etc. to prevent you from accidentally performing these functions. However, if you are sure of what you are intending to do and wish to overcome this policy, then it could be done using a simple registry level fix. Press the Windows key and the R button. Type the command REGEDIT and hit enter to open the registry editor. Then go to this path, H key current user, software, Microsoft, Windows, current version, explorer. I have already scrolled till here for you. And in explorer, you will find that in the right pane, you can find an option called multiple invoke prompt minimum, which I do not find here. So I can create one. I'll copy this keyword. I'll go to the registry editor in the right pane. I'll click on an open space, select new, go to DO 32 bit value and name it multiple invoke prompt minimum. Hit enter. Now I'll double click on this to open its editor window. The value data here would represent the number of files you can select together and still get those options. So by default, it could be 15 if you have not created this entry. But if you wish that number to be unlimited, mention this value data as 16 instead of 15. Now 16 does not mean 16 values here. 16 means unlimited values here. Any number till 15 would mean as many files would come under that policy. 16 means that unlimited files are excluded from this policy. So I'll select it at 16 and click on OK. Now I will get the open, print and edit options in the context menu, no matter how many files I select. Isn't this easy? If you have any doubts, please go to the original article on the Windows Club. Scroll down to the comment section and write your query. We will surely answer to it. Do not forget to subscribe to the channel. Thank you for watching this video and have a nice day.